1988, a child was born in the suburbs of Manchester City in England. From the moment the baby was born prematurely, he had to fight against all odds to stay alive, and he would have to face the entire world as he walked the stony path to success, only to fall down and rise high again. This child was none other than Tyson Luke Fury, or the famed Gypsy King, the undefeated champion of heavyweight boxing. When Fury was born as a premature baby weighing just one pound at birth, the doctors predicted that he wouldn't live long. However, he proved them all wrong. Fury's father, John Fury, who was a professional boxer at the time, had high hopes for his son and hoped that one day he would follow in his footsteps and make him proud, named his boy Tyson after the legendary boxer, Mike Tyson. By the time his tiny little son turned 14, he was already taller and stronger than his father. Fury decided to enter professional boxing under his father's coaching and took his first steps in the long road toward success. He debuted in 2008 and defeated all of his six opponents in the next few months. The next year, Fury defeated the English heavyweight champion John McDermott and won his first belt. At this rate, it was impossible to ignore Fury's natural talent in the sport. However, it was also getting impossible to ignore his racist and anti-Semitic comments. In 2013, Fury received harsh criticism due to his offensive remarks, and the number of his fans greatly diminished. Later on, he attributed his offensive remarks to his waning mental health, but many believed it to be a mere excuse. When Fury wasn't fighting, he managed to garner attention with his antics, showing up with superhero costumes to press conferences and mocking his opponents with witty remarks. By now, the number of his haters were beginning to outweigh the number of his fans, and most people were hoping for Vladimir Klitschko to teach Fury a lesson in his match against him in 2015. Klitschko was the heavyweight champion of WBA, IBF, and WBO, and he'd never been defeated even once in his 11 years as a professional boxer. However, the unthinkable happened, and Fury emerged victorious out of this fight. Fury had managed to defeat the champion who'd remained undefeated for more than 10 years, and his career had taken a sharp turn. However, what should have been the start of a wonderful era in Fury's life went downhill. When all eyes were on Fury, he turned to drinking and drugs and fell into depression. He lost his figure and was stripped of all his titles due to his behavior. His name was going down in history as the prime example of who kids shouldn't aspire to be like. But he finally came to his senses after three years. With the help of his family, Fury turned his life around and quit drugs. He sought professional help, overcame his depression, and became an ambassador for mental health to help all those who were in a similar situation. He also published an autobiography in 2019, addressing his controversial past and all his regrets. After defeating Deontay Wilder in 2020 and earning his second heavyweight world championship belt, he returned back to the very top of his career once more, and he keeps going up at a steady rate. However, he still lives in the shadow of his controversial past and has as many haters as he has fans. Despite everything, it remains an undeniable fact that his name will go down as one of the most successful boxers in the entire history of the sport.